you're an easy butterfly. I understand harvest and my mission in life is to get people to appreciate art and wildlife. Show you some tricks in this video, so get out your pencil, paper, and here we go. Okay, this here is the Ulysses butterfly. It's found in the northern parts of Australia and up in Papua New Guinea. A beautiful butterfly. Now, this is going to be a fairly easy one to do, starting off with a paper and pencil and this is just a bit of photocopy paper printer paper very thin starting off with the body the head's going to be there and we're going to start off with a sort of a strange triangular shape like that then we're going to sort of carve into that a bit just reshape it so starting with the triangle shape as a guideline and then you can see we just round off bits and shape bits a little bit differently now we're only going to draw one half of this and this is not going to be the finished drawing either. So it's like a bracket straight bit and a wobbly bit and another wobbly bit and down here sort of like a swallow's tail. It's actually a butterfly called a swallow tail butterfly. So now we're doing the veins a little bit of a shape there and these are just like oh, sort of straightish lines I'm not overly fussed with getting this super accurate and I'll tell you why later but we're going to go you know near enough's good enough get some veins out there so I'll work out where the black goes just something like this I hear a little bit like steps there cool So a wobbly bit there. Yep. And here. It's it a little bit complicated at the top of this here somewhere. Actually a bit there, it's a bit complicated. It looks a bit like a peace sign there. And then ten eye there. I think that's just about it. So now I'm going to go over this with just a marker pen. You can use a Sharpie or any sort of marker would do the job. And now it's just a matter of tracing the whole thing. So I just want those lines to be nice and thick and chunky. Next, I'm going to sticky tape this to a window and put another cling sheet over top of that and now I'm going to trace it with pencil so I want to get every line on there in pencil now next put that aside get the original flip it over Sticky tape that to the window the other way around. And now I'll go line up the two halves where the body is. So see where the two eyes get them sort of even and then trace the other side. And what this does is it makes it look pretty much the same on one side as it is on the other. So if you have made mistakes, those mistakes look like they're meant to be because they're on both sides. Now again, what we're going to do is the marker pen, we're just going to go over it. And because there's a little trick that we've done, it is symmetrical. And because it's symmetrical, it looks right. Okay, so that's the outline. Going to blacken in a few areas here. I 
Often when you look at butterflies, they're actually not symmetrical. There's usually faults. But uh, making them symmetrical like this makes them look pretty cool. So now I'm using some coloured pencil to fill in the colour. I might use a few different shades of blue. I'll go over it a few times. The more times you go over it, the more dense that colour is. Chucking a little bit of green in the centre here. And intensify this a bit more. And that's just about it. So that was it, how to draw a butterfly. That was a tricky one, wasn't it? Good to know those tricks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know you guys love wildlife and you want to express it in a creative way, so I hope I've given you some few tips to do so. I'm going to go now, so until next time, maybe check out some of my other videos. See you later.